Yechezkel, Ezekiel 36. Also, son of Adam, prophesy unto the mountains of Yashara'el and say, Ye mountains of Yashara'el, hear the word of Yahweh. Thus says Adonai Yahweh, because the enemy has said against you, Aha, even the ancient high places are ours in possession. Therefore prophesy and say, Thus says Adonai Yahweh, Because they have made you desolate and swallowed you up on every side, that ye might be a possession unto the remnant of the heathen, and ye are taken up in the lips of talkers and are an infamy of the people. Therefore, ye mountains of Yashara'el, hear the word of Adonai Yahuwah. Thus says Adonai Yahuwah to the mountains and to the hills, to the rivers and to the valleys, to the desolate wastes and to the cities that are forsaken which became a prey and derision to the remnant of the heathen that are round about. Therefore, thus says Adonai Yahweh, Surely in the fire of my jealousy have I spoken against the remnant of the heathen and against all Edom, which have appointed eth my land into their possession with the joy of all their heart, with despiteful minds, to cast it out for a prey. Prophesy, therefore, concerning the land of Yashara'el, and say unto the mountains and to the hills, to the rivers and to the valleys, Thus says Adonai Yahuwah, Behold, I have spoken in my jealousy and in my fury because ye have borne the shame of the heathen. Therefore thus says Adonai Yahuwah, I have lifted up at my hand, surely the heathen that are about you, they shall bear their shame. But ye, O mountains of Yashara'el, ye shall shoot forth your branches and yield your fruit to my people of Yashara'el, for they are at hand to come. For behold, I am for you, and I will turn unto you, and ye shall be tilled and sown, and I will multiply men upon you, all the house of Yashadael, even all of it, and the cities shall be inhabited, and the wastes shall be built, and I will multiply upon you man and beast, and they shall increase and bring fruit. And I will settle you after your old estates, and will do better unto you than at your beginnings. And ye shall know that I am Yahweh. Yea, I will cause men to walk upon you, even at my people, Yashara'el. And they shall possess you, and you shall be their inheritance. And you shall no more henceforth bereave them of men. Thus says Adonai Yahuwah, Because they said unto you, rather, because they say unto you, Your land devour up men, and have bereaved your nations. Therefore you shall devour men no more, neither shall bereave your nations any more, says Adonai Yahuwah. Neither will I cause men to hear in the shame, rather to hear in you the shame of the heathen any more. Neither shall you bear the reproach of the people any more. Neither shall you cause your nations to fall any more, says Adonai Yahuwah. Moreover, the word of Yahuwah came unto me, saying, Son of Adam, when the house of Yashadael dwelt in their own land, they defiled it by their own way and by their doings. Their way was before me, as the uncleanness of a removed woman. Wherefore I poured my fury upon them for the blood that they had shed upon the land, and for their idols wherewith they had polluted it. And I scattered them among the heathen, and they were dispersed through the countries, 
according to their way and according to their doings. I judged them. And when they entered unto the heathen, whither they went, they profaned eth my holy name. When they said to them, These are the people of Yahweh, and are gone forth out of his land. But I had pity for my holy name, which the house of Yashadael had profaned among the heathen, whither they went. Therefore say unto the house of Yashadael, Thus says Adonai Yahweh, I do not this for your sakes, O house of Yashadael, but for my holy name's sake, which ye have profaned among the heathen, whither ye went. And I will sanctify my great name, which was profaned among the heathen, which ye have profaned in the midst of them. And the heathen shall know that I am Yahuwah, says Adonai Yahuwah, when I shall be sanctified in you before their eyes. For I will take you from among the heathen and gather you out of all countries and will bring you into your own land. Then will I sprinkle clean water upon you and ye shall be clean from all your filthiness and from all your idols will I cleanse you. A new heart also will I give you and a new ruach will I put within you. And I will take away at the stony heart out of your flesh. And I will give you a heart of flesh. And I will put eth my ruach within you and cause you eth to walk in my statutes. And ye shall guard my judgments and do them. And ye shall dwell in the land that I gave to your fathers. And ye shall be my people. And I will be your Elohim. I will also save you from all your uncleannesses. And I will call for the grain and will increase it and lay no famine upon you. And I will multiply eth the fruit of the tree and the increase of the field, that ye shall receive no more reproach of famine among the heathen. Then shall ye remember eth your own evil ways and your doings that were not good and shall loathe yourselves in your own sight for your iniquities and for your abominations. Not for your sakes do I this, says Adonai Yahuwah. Be it known unto you. Be ashamed and confounded for your own ways, O house of Yashadael. Thus says Adonai Yahuwah, In the day that I shall have cleansed you from all your iniquities, I will also cause you to dwell in the cities and... The wastes shall be built, and the desolate land shall be tilled, where is it lay desolate in the sight of all that passed by. And they shall say, This land that was desolate is become like the Garden of Eden, and the waste and desolate and ruined cities are become fenced and are inhabited then the heathen that are left round about you shall know that I, Yahweh, build the ruined places and plant that that was desolate. I, Yahweh, have spoken it, and I will do it. Thus says Adonai, Yahweh, I will yet for this be inquired of by the house of Yashadael, to do it for them. I will increase them with men like a flock, as the holy flock, as the flock of Yerushalayim in her solemn feasts. So shall the waste cities be filled with flocks of men, and they shall know that I am Yahweh.